Welcome back to Robin Reviews. Uh, I mentioned a few videos ago when I did the Transmetal Optimus Prime Transformers that I had uh, another vintage toy. Um, this toy, I think I got when it first came out, if not right after, about 1991. Then I think my parents threw out a bunch of my toys, and so I, I repurchased it from eBay in 2010, I think. And I've had it ever since. My favorite toy growing up. So uh, if you're not familiar with this fellow, this is AFC Blinky, a uh, Android first class Blinky. Uh, I still have the attachments and uh, this is just one of my favorite toys growing up. Um, he doesn't really do much. Um, he can barely hold his, his pistol that he has, but uh, this is from uh, a cartoon called Bucky O'Hare and the Toad Wars, or just Bucky O'Hare. Um, it's just this most ridiculous sounding show. Um, it had uh, green rabbits in space fighting evil toads. And uh, they were helped by a preteen named uh, Willie DeWitt from San Francisco. And so there was uh, there was Bucky O'Hare. He's the main one of the main characters. Green Toad, Long Ears. Uh, Jenny, who is the girl... Um, Sorry, not the toad, not the green toad. My apologies. Bucky Hair was the green rabbit with the long ears, and then Jenny was the girl rabbit. Uh, they were against the toads. Again, they had Billy, who, again, he, if you look on Wikipedia, he's literally described as preteen from San Francisco. Um, Dead Eye Duck, who is another toy that uh, I have to be honest, if I get the opportunity to, I'll have to get him again. He was literally a uh, duck pirate, so one eye dead eye um with six arms uh and so i might have to get him again um uh, but to me none of them compares to blinky here i just call him blinky uh, i know i repurchased this one but he's in great shape uh he can stand up but he can also sit and so i mean simple but i love him you can find out more about bucky o'hare um online and uh yeah if you get a chance you should definitely read up about it um I know that in, I think, 2017, um, there was a new wave released of Bucky O'Hare toys. At least there were for Dead Eye Duck. I, I think they came out with a really uh, odd colored version of him. Uh, so I might have to pick one of those up. But this is the classic. This is from uh, 1999. Uh, it's been a while since I even tried to take the pack off. Let me see if I can. Um, yeah, you can see there. Um, I don't know if it's going to focus, but it is uh, copyright 1990, made by Has, uh, distributed by Hasbro Inc. Made in China, and so that is my favorite. It's about as retro as you can get for me. Uh, about as uh, nostalgic as you can get. I mean, I didn't even watch too much of this show, but for some reason when I saw this. Blinky, this uh, Android first class at Blinky, uh, who had probably one of the best catch, catchphrases in any show at that time. Uh, how he described situations is calamity and woe. Calamity and woe. Um, so obviously he's not much of an optimist, but uh, that's just who he was. Um, yeah, just as, as vintage goes, this is vintage for me. Nostalgic. And I love I love Blinky. He goes, uh, he's like a good luck charm that I put in my office with me, and so uh, you should check that out if you ever want to learn more about AFC Blinky. I will put a link in the comments. I'll use the uh, probably the Wikipedia page for the links for this one. So check it out if you're able and interested. Thanks for watching.